find the missing number. Uh, this is what is given 64 is to question mark in a similar way 72 is to 53. So there is some relationship between 72 and 53 in a similar fashion there is a relationship between 64 and question mark find out that question mark. So basically the explanation goes as follows this this 53 here is equal to 7 squared plus 2 squared 7 and 2 are the digits of the first number so 49 plus 4 53. In a similar way this 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 question mark here should be equal to what? 6 squared plus 4 squared. This sounds right. Yes or no? So 6 squared 36, 4 squared 16, 36 plus 16 is 52. So yes, we can conclude that the question mark is 52. Option C. Yeah, this sounds appropriate and option C, 52 can be taken as a correct answer. Find the missing number. So this is basically a number analogy based question. 64 is to question mark in the same way as 72 is to 53. And I'm sure uh, all of us will give it a try. We may or may not get the answer, right? Remember, there are infinite ways of framing questions on number analogy or number series, right? There are logics are indefinite, right? So you have to be very careful. Don't end up wasting your precious time in trying to crack such questions. You may or may not get it, right? May or may not get. So if you get it well and good in the first 15, 20 seconds, otherwise just move on. Now, what do we do? What's the, what's the uh, idea here? What's the logic in getting 72 and 53 as a pair once you decipher that logic we can answer what comes in place of question mark i think it works as follows see 72 53 is actually as follows 53 is equal to 7 squared plus 2 squared 7 and 2 are the digits right 7 is digit 2 is a digit so square of both those digits some of the squares of those two digits will give you 53 7 square 49 2 square 4 49 plus 4 53 so basically the second number is the sum of the squares of the digits are the first number. So if you apply the same logic here, same pattern here, what happens? Question mark should be equal to 6 squared plus 4 squared. 6 squared 36, 4 squared 16. Yes or no? Question mark should be equal to 6 squared plus 4 squared. 6 squared 36 and 4 squared is 16. 36 plus 16, 52. So this should be equal to 52. I think this is the... The, the, I, I think this logic works. This logic really works in getting the answer. There should not be any confusion. ITSK is to MVUN. So, what is the uh, pattern that is followed here? So, you have I, then J, K, L, and M. Correct? So, you have plus 4. I plus 4 gives you M. Similarly, T, U, and then V. So, T plus 2 is V. Then S, T, and U. Again, S plus 2 is U. Then you have K, L, M, N. So, K plus 3 is N. Okay. So, same pattern. Try for A, P, O, C. What you get? A, P, O, C will be A plus 4. That is after A, B, C, D and E. This is going to be E. Then after P, P plus 2, Q and R. Right. At this point itself, you know this is going to be the answer because there is no other option which has E, R. Then you have O. O plus 2. Correct. O plus 2 is L, M, N, O. Uh, P, N, Q. Similarly, plus 3. C, D, E, N, F. So, the correct answer is E, R, Q, F.